of Sparky Face 5, who is well known in the 3D printing community as a super awesome modeler. And she is the one who put me in touch with Spiky Bonbon, bon, and I'm glad she did. You know, it's funny, it's one of those situations where it's almost unfair to everybody else. Because between between Spiky Bonbon bon and Sparky Face 5, there's so much talent in that family, it's just not fair for the rest of us. <laughs> I'm joking, of course. You are super talented, but... I am glad that everything in the universe has worked out the way it has. Rabbit emotes? Yeah, she wanted to see if there was any rabbit emotes. <clears throat> now she's going to see if she can find the recipe to cook them. Okay, apparently we have a web surfing rabbit. Very interesting. And a magazine reading rabbit. Can I have my magazine back? <laughs> That's funny. Here, you want to read the magazine, you can read the magazine with me. down here where you guys can see what I'm doing. Kind of, sort of. Are you happy? Shh. I don't think he knows how, Mom. There we go. Oh, yeah. And I forgot to draw a line here, because... Yeah. That's going to have to be two pieces. Now, if I had a grinder, I could cut that out, but I'm just going to... Um, or, I meant a uh, saw. I'm sorry, I'm misspeaking again, because I'm trying to draw and think at the same time. If you can call what I'm doing drawing. You can use the grinder. Right, I'm going to get a fresh piece of paper. I will continue to recycle that piece, but Bye. for this moment. Yes, Harold. Can I get one of these, though? No. We've done something for a special project. Hi.
Yes, Harold. I will use it up here, Harold. Right there. Harold's favorite color is red, so that's why he's all worried about it. Aren't you? Yes. But nobody can hear me. I'm sure they can hear you just a bit through my microphone. Through your microphone? Right here. Okay, that's enough. Okay, Daddy. Thank you. You're welcome. fit there we go oops I think, I think that'll do. I'll just lop the top off of it and grind it smooth. And it could be. And it's one step closer. Thanks for the host, Rumble. is where these ring star pliers really, really shine. I said, you get, get some curve out of it, but to get extreme curves, you need a... Uh, It's not just you, Spikey. It seems like we're uh, we're lagging here too, and we weren't last night. So I don't know if the Twitch servers are having a problem, or uh, or what. Thanks, Rumble. Thanks for the kind words. Careful, Harold. Harold stop Please starting. watch where you're touching again. Oh, a GIF? A GIF, yeah. I knew what it was. I was just... Uh, Rumble says, love what you're doing. Keep up the great work. Yep. And that's what I was saying thank you for. I wasn't sure. Come on. I would sure wish... So I've got a little lag here, too. So I wonder if there's some kind of server issue going on somewhere. All right, loud noise warning incoming.
All right, let's see how it fits. I'm going to leave it on until we know it fits good. Okay, I need to trim just a fuzz. Looks like off of right here and the bottom. So again, loud noise. Test it again. All right, I'm going to work on that little upper part right there. That's right there is about as tight as I can expect to get that uh, little curve there. Excuse me. Ah, you got water everywhere. A big towel. Yeah. What are the hand towels, though? Please. Go get the one that's in the kitchen. Nothing was hurt, just spilled a little water. Don't. Here, Daddy. Yes. Thank you. No real damage was done, fortunately. Ah, I'm caught on my own cord again. Yes, Harold. Dude, I'm right here too. Right here. Yes. One more time, folks. Dad has to fit that right there. There. I just wanted to make that a little straighter. Hey. Shh. Yes, yes, I see. Thank you. No. Don't get so excited. It's okay. I'm not even working over there yet. Right, turning the grinder off. I'm going to keep that handy. Bring my chair back down here so we can foil. And I don't kill my back. Alrighty. There we go. Yeah, I see the stream's lagging pretty bad. I have no idea why.
now that Rumble's here, uh, that kind of reminds me, I guess I'll take this time while I'm foiling uh, to talk about a cause that I really want to get off the ground here in El Paso, and that is Enable. And those are, uh, it's an organization that uh, promotes and certifies uh, people with 3D printers to print uh, prosthetics for uh, needy children, especially those who can't afford a regular prosthetic that costs thousands of dollars. And uh, so what I want to do is, um, number one, after I get a 3D printer, get certified in as many different models of 3D printed enable hands as I can. And number two, I want to uh, get acquainted with the local children's hospital here in El Paso and work with them so I can actually help some people out. And with any luck, maybe I can start a full chapter here in El Paso, because the nearest chapters, I believe there's one in Albuquerque, which is four hours away. And the next nearest one, I think, is in Austin or someplace, which is like nine hours away. Hello, I'm young. Yes, it's a long drive. Oh, good. You figured it out. Good job, Spikey. Hopefully, some of the little tidbits I told you helped you. I just, I, I have a real hard time uh, wording directions. I, I have a much easier time showing people how to do things. And I apologize for that. My brain is just kinetically oriented instead of being learning by reading or hearing. I learn by doing. Well, I mean, you learn a little bit by hearing and reading and stuff, but um, it's it's a lot easier. Well, of course, on accident, silly. It's not like she's potty trained. Why don't you... Uh, Well, mom will decide to put her up when she's ready, so I'm not worried about it. Yes, Harold. Not only that, but she's not a dog. They're not exactly easy to potty train. But it's fiber. Wrong type of fiber. My pet bunny wanted the. What they call? Okay, Harold. Yes, we know, Harold. You know, you don't have to yell. Oh, it didn't get all the way. You pencil? Yes. Now I'm gonna have to start over because there's no way I'm gonna line it back up the way it was. Thank you. 
cooking. We have about a five minute lag time. There we go. <laughs> that that's an okay suggestion. <laughs> it's, the, it's just the streaming. It's it's slow tonight, okay? Oh. You couldn't ask for a much better fit from a pre cut piece than that. Yes, that's gonna be quite nice. Oh even mess with cutting it, I'm just gonna go straight to the grinder. Yes, Harold. You're welcome, Daddy. I said yes, not thank you. Yes, you're driving mommy nuts. Alright. Grinder we go. Loud noise. Oh, I see we lost our feed. I don't know when I lost it. Come on. I just have to refresh in OBS.
right, let's see how this sucker fits. Uh, you. What happened? I'm caught up in my string, or my cord. There we go. There we go. Ha ha. What do you think, guys? I think it looks pretty good. Harold. Harold. Again, I apologize to everybody for the lag. I don't know why we're having this issue tonight. It was just fine last night. Can I move your pistol? Yes, you may. Go away and stay. Thank you.
Well now, folks. Whoops. How's that for a fit? <laughs> we got the thumbs up of Harold James. I think I can just take this piece. There we go. Can I hold it down? Just a minute, Harold. And I'm going to go ahead and break it. Right. There. <laughs> yes, we've got 3D. We'll have one of those eventually. Daddy? Yes, Harold? Huh? No. Oh, we said the magic words. Now we've got a frenzy in the house. We don't even have a 3D printer yet, and my boys are already gaga over the prospects. Yep. Of course, it's not like we haven't watched plenty of uh, Joel and Angus and uh, Fun King 3D, a little 3D printing professor here and there. Some uh, some Chuck Hallibuck. I don't know who that. That's Chep. Filament Friday. Ring a bell. Oh, yeah. And then you got today. That was yesterday. No, that's today. Yes, Harold. Um, the the three is a hat of B, B and then you make a uh a, a straight line. Okay, excuse me, Harold. Harold. Down. Harold. Harold James. Yes. I need to speak. Your mom's trying to talk to you, please. No, I'm actually trying to talk to you. 
you. Spanky Mom Bob said, sorry, but I've got to, got to have to skedaddle, got to have lunch, then might stream later for an hour or two. Stay awesome. Okay, thanks. Thanks for joining me. We're almost to the end anyway. We've only got about 15 more minutes. Look. Hmm. That was an unintended break. That was really strange. All right, ladies and gentlemen, loud noise alert. Let me, uh, come on. There we go. Loud noise. Let's see how this fits real quick. That looks pretty good. So the paper comes off easier, Harold. Oh. Then you dump it two times to make it super Yes. Quick. No, to get the rest of the glue off. Okay. I know this is not the best camera, but that's a pretty good fit. Back to the foil. Thank you. You're welcome.
could put it in the day. I can put it in the trap. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Here, can you get this one too? Thank you. There it is. Almost a free. Yes. You stop your swirling. And I'm moving it. No, you're moving me. And I'm going to move the couch. I think Carol. Don't argue, please. I said you're moving me, as in other words, your legs are pushing my feet off the couch. I kind of wanted to get to this big black piece. It looks like we might have just enough time. Might go just a hair over just to get that done. Loud noise. Oh, I almost forgot my camera. Loud noise warning. I've been on a hot streak, so I'm going to take a chance and turn it off. Oop, 
There we go. Whoa, oh, I just dropped it. Hey, Daddy. Thank you, Harold. Or is it this way? Nope, definitely not that way. Alright, I'm going to trim just a little bit off of this edge here. Unless it goes better this way. Definitely this way. Loud noise! <clears throat> That looks true enough. You get your camera here. Yes, I did because I was just doing a little touch up job. Yeah, it definitely fits the best this way. Oops. No, just leave it out. I might be able to use it for some of the small pieces. When it comes to do, doing crafts, most of the time there's no such thing as a mistake. As Bob Ross used to say, only happy little accidents. Way before your time, my son. Yeah, let's put it this way. Bright barely remembers watching him. Talking to the bunny deer? Talking to the bunny or what? No, the child. The rabbit's in its cage, just eating its lettuce.
All right. Oh, and I lost the camera somewhere in there. Well, well it must have just happened because I had the camera when I sat down. Really? There it goes. All right. And so we have 3D done. So this is a good stopping place. Harold approves. I'm going to stop my little camera. And I'm going to find somebody to host. Alrighty. Oh, let's see. We've got some good choices. Well, I'm going to raid Katira. So, let's forward slash Raid. <laughs> Mom, if you would uh, go into chat and join the raid. Join the raid. No, just go into the chat and hit that little thing. See the little bar? Hit the little bar. Tap on the little bar. See at the very top? Yep, yep, you're good. One tap. You want join? I did. Absolutely. Okay. Absolutely. Okay. You leave it alone. That way, I at least have one person. It just let me, uh, talk. Uh, messing with the keyboard is is rough. Okay. Just say rabbit squirrels. Shout out Cyrus. Go check out go check out Bernstein's Tink Dork. Um we work what were you working on today? Boop the rabbit squirrels! Yes. <laughs> Thank you so so much. Um, you know we're gonna pause this. Cause um first off, I was gonna say hello, those that are not familiar with moi. I am Katira. You can also just call me Kit. Stained glass. Oh, that's right. You were sold on stained glass stuff. How's that going? Um, but hello, I am Katira. Uh, I do creative and game streaming, switching stuff off here and there. Today we're working 